Hey, what's up everybody and welcome back to another Skyrim mod review. Today we are checking out a super, super cool release and that's going to be the Iron Weapons Redone by El Sopa. Now this is going to completely overhaul all of the vanilla iron weapons. As you can see, they have not only changed the textures, but also the meshes. Some of them have gotten a complete redesign while others stay pretty true to their vanilla variants. So lots of really, really cool stuff going on here. I love the textures in this. It's available in just about every resolution, all the way from up to 4K, which is what you're seeing on screen, down to 1K or even down to 512, which you see so seldom that I don't even know how to say it correctly, but 512. So really this can be run by just about anybody. Now, like I said, this covers every single iron weapon, including the iron dagger that you see on screen here complete with beautiful leather wrapping. The iron looks like it was actually fashioned out of iron, which is saying something that's really important. It was hard to tell that in the vanilla game because the resolutions were just so low, but here you can really see it. And it's obviously beautiful because I just got you to sit through 20 seconds of panning over the iron dagger. That's right, these are some amazing textures. As we can see, the iron greatsword here looks beautiful. The iron war axe, also great. They're just enough crude but also look like they were made to be proper weapons there's a beautiful balance going on here even the iron mace looks beautiful now which is really saying something truly some awesome craftsmanship happening here really beautiful textures the iron greatsword also looks amazing i really really like the texture work on this one and all of these look just as beautiful in third person as they do in first person now keep in mind what your pc can handle because the 4k even on my 3080 was it was chugging a little bit but Definitely worth grabbing this overhaul. Again, available in every single texture size that you could possibly want. Up here we have actually my favorite of this pack, which is going to be the Battle Axe. I really love the way that it's attached to the handle. Some really, really cool meshes as well as textures here. Super lore friendly, definitely one that you don't want to miss out on. And the links, as always, will be down in the description below. There just isn't enough that I can possibly say about these weapon mods. I know it seems like something simple, it's just a remesh and a retexture of the iron weapons, and I've been wanting something like that for a very long time. There was Nord Wars mod, but I actually use that in conjunction with the vanilla weapons. I think Amidium Born is a great retexture option, however, it doesn't change any meshes. It's a great retexture, but you still get stuck with things like the vanilla iron mace look. This mod has you covered in every single way. Beautiful textures, beautiful meshes, and it just completely replaces them. So if you hate the iron weapons in the base game, this is probably the best mod out there right now that does exactly what you're looking for. It replaces them completely. It has a lot of customizability, not just in the different resolutions that are available, but you can also change the resolution in not only the weapons, but also in the scabbards that hold the weapons. So you could choose to have the 4K weapons themselves, but 1K scabbards so that you don't waste resolution where you don't need to. So super cool mod. I won't ramble anymore. This really is one that you should just go try out for yourself. Seeing it on screen isn't as good as seeing it in game. So I encourage you to check this one out. It really is amazing. With that being said, I hope you go out there and support the mod author. If you do enjoy this mod, click the endorse button after you're done downloading it. And if you enjoy it enough, consider donating. This is some really, really quality stuff. And more than anything, just show your appreciation for all of the mod author's hard work. And if you enjoyed this video, drop a rating, consider subscribing for more content just like this and other Fallout and Skyrim modding content. And I hope to see you in the next video. Peace. And hey, shout out to all of our patrons for their continued support. As always, your donations are greatly appreciated and help to fund videos just like this one. So again, thank you.